True Jamaican vibes, fair read. Trust me, you know right now I'm in the country. Look some fruits and plus me going to the Jamaican maros. You know the Jamaican maros, a lot of mud and stuff. So I've been touring the Jamaican maros this morning in Burns of St. Elizabeth. So right now, you see if we get some freshly picked fruits that is I'm call it star fruit. Star fruit. So I pick some of them and enjoy it. True Jamaican vibes, fair read. Like, share and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell for more videos. Yeah man, trust me, country life sweet. So yeah man, so you see it's star fruit in my waist, you know? A lot of star fruit. So you see we have a lot of things in the country. So I picked two of them fruit and eat it before I go to the Jamaican Maras, you know? See it here? Yeah? You call it star fruit. Come on. Nothing cannot be the country life. And this have a lot of health benefit also, you know, a lot of health benefit. Yeah man, so I picked one and start out and see what I go on here. Yeah? Yes, the people see it here. Yeah. Star fruits, you know. I'm call it Jimbili in Jamaica. Jimbilin, Jimbilin. But some people call it star fruit. Yeah man. Do a closer look. So I pick some and care warm to make some juice, you know? Those are true Jamaican vibes. So look, I keep on watching my paper but I know so we are going to the, um, the Maros. You know, so the Jamaican Maros have a lot of mud. So we are touring Jamaican Maros this morning. So here are some gungu tree. You know, so gungu and rice and peas. So this is a gungu tree. Also, you have a pumpkin right here. Just love your country life, you know? So, you have got through a lot of bushes, you know? So, we are going to the Jamaican Maros this morning. Yeah man, just the vibes. So this is what the, um, the Jamaican Maros look like, so I'm going to take you further.
So you know, so in the Maros, a lot of farming take place in the Maros and stuff. A lot of animals. So in the morris you find a lot of rushes. So a lot of dashing plants in the morass, a lot of dashings. See, to get to their farm, they have to walk on a piece of bamboo. So you see on, on the next side, you have a lot of dashing over there. So you have to walk on a piece of bamboo across the water. Yeah, man, those are Jamaican vibes, you know? So you have a lot of wild palm in the Maros, a lot of wild palm. So we have some dashing suckers here, some dashing. So those are some dashing. So in the morass you have a lot of blue holes. And you know them say blue hole don't have any bottom. So we have to be careful. So this right here is a dashing. So it's a very soft place, very, very soft. Look right here. See that? Can I use the machete and just cut it, you know? Very, very soft. So let me call it a mud. Yeah, man.
So you can farm anything in the Maros, any kind of vegetable in the Maros. You can plant your cabbage, tomatoes, carrot, and you get a different growth. So if you want to do some good farming, you just need to come at a Maros. See they call them and eat, you know, so them can't out of water. A lot of green grasses and stuff. So in the Maros right now, where I'm at right now, you can use the Maros and go straight into Black River. Also into Lockover Bridge. This can take you right to the Black River Bridge or to the safari, but you have to use a canoe. Water cleany. Yeah, man, so I'm just like going to a tour of Jamaica and Maros because a lot of persons don't know what the Maros is like. And now see have some wild palm in the Maros. You have some wild palm. So you call them the, the wild palm. You see them tree there? Like a palm tree, but it's a wild one. So you call them the wild palm tree. This tree right here, they call, them, they call it the milky tree. Back in the days, we used to use it and make it swing shot. They call it catapult. Use it to shot bird. As you can see, vehicle tracks. So you know vehicle come at them place here. Yeah? Come pick up them dashing and stuff. And take feeding for the animals. So welcome to the Jamaican Mars. So you know in the Mars you have um, a different type of fish. You have them called the blackfish. Call it blackfish, you know. Also, have a gravel tree in the Mara, same way. You know, gravel have a lot of health benefits. Good for high cholesterol. Yeah, man. Those are Jamaican vibes, you know? Fire read. Like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And hit the notification bell for more videos. Yeah, man. So this is where there's a pan right here. Like them dig it up with backhoe. So them can raise them fish also. So them call them the rush. You have two types of rush in the Maros. You have a one where it's very cutty. If you drop on your skin it will cut you. But that one it don't really cut you. So them use, use this one to make like a special bed for, for the baby. If you have a baby and you want to make a nice cushion for him, you use this type of rush. So you have two types of rush. Tell them about your life, you know. Nothing can be the country life.
So you have to be careful on our walking in the morass because you fall off and stuff. Yeah man. Cross some way you know, you know. So you have a pan right there. A lot of fish, different types of fish. But the people make them pan here still for them own personal stuff. So people use like backhoe and dig up it. So first thing that's see some different type of fish, them call it the blackfish. So you know see so the blackfish good with okra and bami, well steamed. So as you see, I'm in the middle, so I'm surrounded by two waters. So I'm in the middle right now, trying to get cross. Yeah, I'm on. So I'm going to go on different side of the Maros. So I'm going to go through the whole hills here. Whole heap of little macaw hack and stuff for it. So you don't know what so they call them the lago tree. Very tough tree. The lago tree. Heart come like an iron. And normally the lago have a different color. Have a red color. When you put it to dry, it's very red. So right now I'm in the Jamaican Maras. So right now I'm in the Lagood Walk. And trust me, a lot of mosquitoes and stuff right now biting. So you see it kind of more darker. So I'm in the Lagood Walk. So welcome to my channel, True Jamaican Vibes, Fire Read. So you know, in the Maros is some different style. You find some different type of style in the Maros, some different style. I have a lot of wild palm in the area. Come like in the jungle, you know. So this is a mango tree right here. So from a boy days, we see them call here so the boarhood. So you have a lot of palm tree, so they used to call here, so the boarhood. But right now we come like we're in the jungle. Oh man. 
nawasikiza dem bad no so back in the days I used to have one spring right here a tree right here so I'm gonna save me find one spring right here long time long time I come in the morning you know ears so right here is a look never out of water yet Back in the days, we used to like catch some different type of fish. Them call them mud fish. So they always not the mud. But this is never out of water yet. Tell you, mask them terrible. All right, just keep on watching. So this is what the maras look like. So you have a lot of gravel tree. Yes, my people, so right now I'm on a different side of the Maras this morning. So it's a long journey. A lot of walking. So I'm going to show you now well from ancient days. Found me out a boy, I know them well, you know. Never out of water yet. Yeah, man, see it? Have some gravel. This well never out of water yet, never run dry. So more time when the community don't have no water, the man always come to that well right here. So. I'm going to do them washing and I also hold them shower also. So right up in the hillside uh, up there you can find is Rich Eve Mountain in St. Elizabeth. If you're looking straight up you see a hill. Up there you can call it the Rich Eve Mountain. But right now I'm in the Maras in Burnt Savannah Maras. So it's a lot of walking. Keep your body fit. So this right here is an old canoe. People used to take them canoe and go river and stuff, you know. So this is an old canoe. So we're getting a lot of rain in Jamaica and stuff, a lot of rain. So this is a duck ants nest. Everyone's supposed to know a duck ants nest. 
Uh, open it so no one will see it. So you call them the duck hands. Yeah man. Just a country life too, you know. You can see it's very soft, a lot of mud. See it's surrounded by water. So you have a gel and over in the Maros, them call over there, them call over there is the Pitek. So you have a gel and over, over in the Maros, right? So. You can build a little hut and stuff over there. A lot of people, a lot of people visit the Maros. A lot of persons. So right here, see the relaxed area. So for people to make a daily living, this is what they have to walk through to go to their farm. It's not an easy life. As you can see it, be a mud. Mud, mud and soft, soft mud. You have some part in the Mars, right? When you walk on it, it just a shake, it just a shake, it just a shake. So they call it the shaky bed. You can't stand up on it and just move from one side of the morals go to the other side. So they call it the shaky bed. And also you have a lot of blue holes over here. A lot of blue holes. Very dangerous. So thank you for watching my channel, True Jamaican Vibes, Fire Read. So I'm in the burnt savannah Maras. As you can see, you know people come on catch them fish and stuff for them leave them buckles and stuff them water buckle but nice we come at the morals and catch some fish some real black fish yeah man so as me tell you the morals is very soft it's a muddy muddy see that see more time you want to catch all the fish you can find the earthworm. See the worm? So let me use them here and catch a fish them. So if you want to look some bait for you catch some fish enough really you can just come to the morass and just dig the mud. You find a lot of worms. So look at the beauty in the morass era. So it's all about nature for me. I will just walk, walk an era and just check it out. It's just the vibes. So where am I now? I'm in Burnt Savannah, St. Elizabeth. So looking over to that side, you can go to Vineyard, Arlington. Some people used to walk in the Maras and go over to Vineyard. But a lot of water in the Morris right now, so it's kind of a bit hard. So yeah, I try to go back from the Jailan now, you know. Go back up from the Jailan here.
So now it's bird season now in Jamaica. So you're gonna find a lot of person in the morass. And they call it the swamp area. They're gonna shoot birds. Yeah, so thank you all for watching my channel, True Jamaican Vibes, Fire Read. One love and one heart, you know?